All right, we're back. By one of Aperture's Nobel Prize winners. It doesn't say what the prize was for. For well, I know it wasn't for being immune to neurotoxin. Oh, get wrecked, guy. Okay. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Got it. Got it. Oh. I didn't. In fact, we're headed to your surprise right now. After all these years, I'm getting choked up just thinking about it. Yeah. I'll probably get all choked up too. Not in the sense that you were. Oh, come on. I'm just too good. I'm breezing through all the, the, the test chambers like it's nothing. So these loading screens are too frequent. And it's just too much. The surprise! Yay! Ooh. Initiating surprise in three, two, one. Ooh. I made it all up. Yep. Surprise. Oh, come on. If it makes you feel any better, they abandoned you at birth. So I very seriously doubt they'd even want to see you. Nice. Oh, he can see me from there. All right, I'm gonna pop that one there. Um, yeah, personal shield. Now, how do I do this one again? Nope. There's some trick to it. Okay. See over here. That's where the box is. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. See, if it hadn't been for putting that there, they would have just slammed into each other around there, falling into the goop, and I would have had to try again. Is there nothing I can do about you yet? Oh well. You'll be taken care of soon enough. Now. No, wait. Can I get him? There we go. Alright, that's him taken care of. Now. I want them... Uh, yep, that looks good. Go on. Jump. 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 Jump! Gotcha. And now... I just line up all these nice in a row. And boom! Let's give your parents a call. Well, at least it's all official here.
Hey. How's it going? I talked my way onto the nanobot work. Oh, there. They are reasonable. I know, Jerry. No, I'm on a break, mate. I'm on a break. Ah! Just hang in there for five more. Oh, Jerry, you can't fire me for that. Yes, Jerry. Or maybe your prejudiced work site should have accommodated a nanobot of my size. Thanks for the hate crime, Jerry. See you in court, mate. Anyway, yeah. just hang in there for, for five more chambers. Yep. Yeah. Discrimination in a workplace. That affects robots too. Well, you know the old formula. Comedy equals tragedy plus time. And you have been asleep for a while. So I guess it's actually pretty funny when you do the math. Yeah. I need that box. Now I have the box. Okay. Now. 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 Yep, there we go. Boom. One down. Hang on. Okay, that's good. The problem is... Yep. See, I couldn't have just, like, I couldn't actually get up to the platform. So, of course, I have to do some other tricks. Wait, no. Gotcha. Now I get back up there. Ow. That goes up there. Put you there. Put you there. Boom. And away we go. I thought about our dilemma, and I came up with a solution that I honestly think works out best for one of both of us. Well, I suppose if you can't think of one that works out for both of us, then making one of us happy is just the next most logical conclusion. So, I can't fault you for that, really. There we go. Federal regulations require me to warn you that this next test chamber is looking pretty good. It is actually. That's right. The facility is completely operational again. It's got everything working. Now. Now. Wait, wait, wait. You'll be impressed by this. Looks really cool. Boom! Look at that. All angles and shit. I think these test chambers look even better than they did before. It was easy, really. Well, yeah. You just have to look at things objectively, see what you don't need anymore, and trim out the fat. Hey! That's a euphemism. I think she's planning to kill me. That crazy kid is coming to kill me. Uh, come on. Lord. Uh. I've got a surprise for you after this next test. Not a fake tragic surprise like last time. A real surprise with tragic consequences. Uh. And real confetti this time. The good stuff. Okay. Our last bag. 
part of me is going to miss it. But at the end of the day, it was just taking up space. Alright, let's go get the... Hang on. Uh, I don't think this test chamber can work. No, wait. There we go. Ah, oh, bollocks. No, yeah, it works. Alright, let's get the. Oh. Who turned off the lights? Hey, buddy! I'm speaking in an accent that is beyond her range of hearing. Look. You don't sound that much different. Run, I don't need to do the voice. Run! Okay. Run! Go, 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 go. I'm running! You said five! That was two! Maybe three if you count that one. Either way, that was not the what you said. Going, going. Oh, look! Maybe I should. Nah, it's fine. You 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 get an achievement for doing for going in there, but you just die because she floods it with neurotoxin. But you know you get an achievement, so sure you should do it. I shouldn't because I've already done it, and doing it again would be a waste of my time and your time and the time of everyone else involved. Then again, I do everything and you just watch it, so it is just you and me involved. I don't know why that's mentioned and everyone else. But. Whatever. I don't give a fuck. Oh no! Alright. Boom! Yep. Yep. Bye bye. Boom, boom, boom. Come on. Bunny hopping. Bunny hopping saves lives. Oh god. Oh. Oh god. Oh yeah. It's a good thing I wasn't in there. That looked cool. Oh great, another loading door. Uh, well, at least now we don't have to run everywhere. We could if we wanted to. Who the fuck is we? It's not me and you, because you're not playing the game. And it's not me and Wheatley, because he doesn't have legs, so he can't run. It's just me. Don't you fucking forget it. Chapter 5, The Escape. Ah, oh, great. Okay. Um, hmm, okay. Okay. Uh, don't move. Okay. Okay. Not moving. Right, so I've got an idea, but it is bloody dangerous. Here we go. Ah! Oh, for God's sake! They told me that if I ever turned this flashlight on, I would die. They told me that about everything. I, mean, I don't even know why they bother giving me this stuff if they didn't want me to use it. It's pointless. Mad. That is a bit stupid. Ooh. It's dark down here, isn't it? They say that the old caretaker of this place went absolutely crazy. Chopped up his entire staff of robots. All of them robots. They say at night you can still hear the screams of their replicas. All of them functionally indistinguishable from the originals. Yep. No memory of the internet. Nobody knows what they're screaming about. Absolutely terrifying. 
though obviously not paranormal in any meaningful way. No. Not even the slightest the bit supernatural. Oh, nicely done. Yeah, there's a bits of turrets. Yeah. It's probably a good idea to avoid the big laser arms. Yes, I can. I tried shooting it too, but it didn't work until you put a light on it. Okay, there's another wall over here. Either that or I just missed. Oh, I'll tell you. Humans? Oh, love them. Just the way they look. It's great. And their folklore. Wonderful. They're very colourful. That's cool. I remember reading a thing where they said they wanted at some point to have the assembly line putting turrets together and then moving them down and immediately dismantling them. But it just took up too much space so they just had the putting them together thing. That would have been funny though. Like, that's the exact kind of shit Aperture would do. Yeah. go. Now. Turret redemption lines active. Please do not engage with turrets heading towards redemption. Alright, no, there we go. We can do that. Turret redemption lines are not rides. Please exit the turret redemption line. No. I'm good, thanks. Hey, that one looks like it's still intact. What's going on, buddy? Okay. If you say so. Well, that's pleasant. What else you got to say? It won't be enough. Oh, okay. That's oddly foreboding. It is? That just looks dark. Whose name is Carolyn? Oh, okay. Fair enough. Well, then... Oh. You're already broken and shit. Maybe I should just throw. Oh, oh. You know what? That's kind of cool. I'm gonna leave you like that. 